Are you looking to improve your volunteer training program? Volunteers are eager to help, so having a robust training program is an essential aspect of your nonprofit organization. In today's video, we're sharing six steps you can take to improve volunteer training at your organization. I'm Noel with Jotform. Let's go. Volunteers tend to be inspired by your nonprofit mission and are eager to do what they can to help. When they sign on to volunteer, they expect to have specific tasks that allow them to contribute to the mission of your organization. This means that it's critical to train volunteers effectively for your program to succeed, as volunteers are likely to quit if they feel their efforts are wasted. So you'll need to provide the right training and resources to boost motivation and improve volunteer retention. Even if your organization has a tight budget, you'll still need to provide some nonprofit, organization-based, and role-based training. So here are six ways you can improve training at your organization. First, set clear goals for your volunteer training program. Goals help volunteers and staff to work together effectively. So set goals that everyone understands, review the job descriptions for volunteers, and make it your goal to educate each volunteer on how their work supports your mission. Once you've done that, decide how you'll complete training and who will be in charge. Consider if you need a manual or workbook for volunteers, if you could provide the training online, and how much hands-on training your volunteers will need. From there, set goals that clearly connect to how and why volunteers receive certain training. Next, be sure to provide options for training. There are seven distinct ways people learn visually, verbally, orally, physically, logically, socially, and solitarily. So while a lecture may work for some, others might need more hands-on instruction. Your trainers should keep in mind that if a volunteer seems to be struggling, they may need to be taught in a different way. For example, if you assign volunteers a manual on the basics of nonprofits, you may want to supplement that with a presentation or one-on-one -on -one training. Then, Create a welcoming atmosphere. Foster a welcoming environment that puts your volunteers at ease and makes a lasting, positive impression. Ensure that the training space is hospitable and provide refreshments during breaks. Volunteers are more likely to quit early on, so this is the best time to focus your retention efforts. Make a point to introduce yourself memorably. A volunteer's introduction to your organization sets a tone so this is when you must establish mutual understanding with your volunteers. Explain all guidelines and procedures at your organization and demonstrate how they've been effective in the past. Showing volunteers what exactly they're getting into will help you identify who's a good fit for your cause. So discuss your organization's goals and where you plan to go in the future. This will help you connect with volunteers who will commit to your organization long term. Remember to make engagement a key component of training. Engagement is a direct way to improve volunteer retention, so make engagement central to your training process. Showing the value of their work will encourage volunteers to donate their time and work to your cause. To increase engagement throughout the training process, try utilizing games, group activities, and role play. Ask volunteers what worked and what didn't during the training process to learn how the program could be improved and make a continual effort to support your volunteers through training. Your training program will have a certain duration, but training is an ongoing process. Engaged volunteers will have questions as they adopt their new roles. Each time they help out is an opportunity for them to learn. So provide supervision and feedback to show your volunteers that your organization cares. Treat volunteers respectfully and professionally to show that they're just as valuable as paid staff and to assure them that they're part of the team. This requires that you actively acknowledge volunteers by providing feedback when appropriate and letting uncommitted volunteers go. The best volunteer training will produce volunteers who are well prepared to join your organization. Through training, volunteers can learn more about your nonprofit and about how they're going to help you achieve your goals. Ultimately, this is what will ensure that volunteers work towards your mission for a long time. Let's do a quick review. Volunteers are often inspired by your nonprofit's mission and are eager to get to work. So to ensure that your organization retains volunteers that are properly engaged and prepared for your mission, 
try implementing these six steps into your volunteer training program. Set clear goals for your volunteer training program. Provide options for training. Create a welcoming atmosphere. Introduce yourself memorably. Make engagement a key component of training and support your volunteers through continual training. I'm Noel, and this is Jot Form. We'll see you next time.